real talk people I just may have torn my pack doing reps at the gym I'm at the emergency I'll keep y'all posted What's up fam, this is your boy Andy Dooley with Andy Dooley Fitness. I wanna thank everybody who's reached out to me, sent their prayers. Um, I had a little mishaps at the gym yesterday. I tore my pec while I was benching and it was on my last set, of course. I was um, benching 335, doing reps, and then on the last set, I brought it down and then I felt the ripping in my chest and I knew something was wrong. I have it actually on video because I was videoing it at the time. So I'm gonna post this in a bit. But um, I just wanted to send this message to you guys really quick, let you know I'm good. Uh, we gotta wait a week before we know the severity of it because there's swelling. If you see, this, it's, on, it's my left pec over here compared to this side. It's swollen. I wish my chest was this huge right now, but not under these circumstances. Um, so right now I'm on pain meds, but I had to get out the house and walk around and get some fresh air because I'll go nuts because I'm not used to just laying around and doing nothing, but I know I got to do it to heal up. So one thing I want to do though is everybody in life has a setback everybody in life go through something and it's always unexpected when you're sitting there thinking you know what i'm gonna do this and this you know everyone has like their um like this year their 2015 goals and what they want to do and and for me i have my certain goals but you know what i don't want to let this um, hold me back from them. I'm already plotting to come back. And so I want to take this mishaps in this situation and turn it into something really good for everybody. So if you've ever been through a setback, it doesn't have to be an injury or anything like that. But if you've ever been through a setback in your life and right now where you're at, you're like, you know what? I need to start over. I need a clean slate and I want to plot my comeback. So let's let's come together and use the hashtag um, the comeback. That's what we're going to use, the hashtag the comeback. Everything you're doing, it'll help remind you where you're going and let's build a community around it where that you may be feeling down and you may feel like things aren't going right things aren't where it's supposed to be but remember it's a comeback you're going to take steps forward you're going to take some steps backwards but you're going to always keep striving to get one percent better every day so this couldn't be at a worse time really for me right now we just had a baby <laughs> we just had a baby got to be bringing these finances in also i was I'm doing this um, contest. I'm a part of this athlete search with one of the most incredible companies I've ever seen. It's called First Form. Um, I'll show you. I'll put a link on there. But what they stand for is amazing. And I would love to be one of their athletes and join their team. I'm not going to let this hinder me. At first, I was thinking I wouldn't even say anything. But you know what? I'm going to use this to help others. I'm going to use this to be able to you know, bring you on my journey, on my comeback. And hopefully I don't have to have surgery, but I'll keep you guys updated. But at least you'll get to know what it's like to tear pectoralis major and how to come back from it. What do you do so you don't just sit around and get fat, you just sit around and get out of shape. You have legs, you can do cardio. I just can't do upper body stuff right now. And hopefully, it's not too serious, it can heal on its own and I don't have to have surgery. After this week, I'll know if I have to get an MRI. But when I had x-rays, um, the muscle didn't tear off the bone or anything like that, so I'm pretty good like that. I'm just, um, I'm just in a lot of pain, but that's to be expected, obviously. And I'm able to talk to y'all right now because I'm on some good pain meds right now. <laughs> but let's, let's, let's get together, man. A lot of us go through a lot of 
issues in our life and it's not just injuries it's not just um, physical it's emotional but there's a comeback and there's a comeback in all of us and let's start today when I post this and you get this any Instagram post you have put the comeback um, any Facebook post you have and trying to help others let's hashtag the comeback I really want to you know use this for good and also go to first form check them out if you guys are looking for uh, supplements and actually check out athletes and people who really care about your being and who you are and not just a self-absorbed you know narcissistic company that's not first form and that's the kind of company I want to be a part of and I want to be one of their athletes but I'm gonna show I'm gonna show them you know what this is not about to hold me down I'm about to come back bigger better than ever stronger uh, more mobile I may incorporate yoga though be real I want to be really limber so my arm is burning right now I got to get off this thing I'm shaking and everything love y'all and I'll talk to y'all soon I'm out Yo, without further ado I'm about to show you guys the video you're gonna see me doing the sets and then I go back to do my last set and then there go my um, pec. Stupid that it happened, but I'm not gonna keep going back and forth. What if I would have done this or that? It, it is what it is. You know, maybe I could have warmed up better, but you know what? I'm already there. I'm in my sling now, but I'm already plotting to come back. It's about to be real. Um, I'm not gonna pity myself. I'm just gonna use this to help you guys. I'm gonna find out all the micronutrients that need to be coming into my body to help with this. I know protein, I'm gonna up my protein intake, my BCAAs, um, magnesium, and copper. That's another thing that helps. So I'll keep y'all posted. So if you ever go through this or even the pre preventative measures to make sure you're bringing these nutrients. Because the nutrients, I'm the reason I'm gonna really have to be on point on my nutrition game is not just because of aesthetics, but just for my internal, my insides, make sure my muscles are getting all the nutrients. Because when we in the gym, we're taxing ourselves, we're killing ourselves and killing our muscles and tearing them up. And we really need to make sure we're getting the proper nutrients to make sure it recovers faster and they're actually healing up. So. You know what? It happened. It is what it is. We gonna turn this for good. It's game time. It's go time. Ladies, fellas, let's get it. Let's get lean. Let's get smarter with our nutrition, smarter with our um, training and recovery and making sure you rest and recover. All right, y'all. Your boy's out. It was at this point I knew I missed it. Oh. 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 Oh.